doesn't it look like 10 times better without that horrible bed in the back oh my gosh we have space well hello and welcome back to my channel everybody if you guys are new here my name is nush and i make reactions here on youtube a few weeks ago we looked at israel's representative for eurovision 2023 Yes, Eurovision 2023. And they are gonna be sending Noah Kirel. Of course, the song has not been announced yet. We are still waiting on that. And I don't think we're gonna find out for a very, very long time. But we looked at her new song, Panther, or Panther, whichever the one is correct. I just absolutely love this girl. I think that she is gonna be one of the Eurovision 2023 icons. Just by looking at one video, I can tell you that. But today I thought we would react to one of Noah's most viewed video that she's got out and it is called Pouch. You guys told me that this one is something I would like, so I hope you're correct. Why don't we get into this and see what Pouch is all about? But before we do so, please do not forget to like and subscribe to my channel over here. That is very important. Uh, licking that notification bell so you don't miss any of my videos. And if you wanna follow me over on Instagram or TikTok, it is Nush101. This has 38 million views. The last one had 11 and I thought that was a lot. This girl knows what she's doing. Anyway, clicking play. Ooh. Ooh, it's starting off good, isn't it? Okay. Trappy Middle Eastern. First of all, I'm not a huge fan of the trap sound. I know I have, keep saying this, but this sounds a little bit promising. Her voice is incredible. I feel like being in America has got me used to this style of music. This bit's good, isn't it? Okay. Ooh. Oh, oh, we love the ethnic vibes, don't we? I really wasn't sure at the first drop that I was gonna like that, but there's something about this Middle Eastern twang in here that is giving this song a little bit more oomph than it normally would. So I'm enjoying it. I mean, look at this music video. It's like a piece of art. I've got one of those. She's born to go to Eurovision. I'm I'm not too sure why she hasn't already. Oh yeah! Da, 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 da. Love that! Look at her though! Yeah, that was really good. Okay, is it my favorite song out of the two that I've reacted to? I don't know. I definitely prefer having more you know, traditional elements in there, which this definitely did. And it changed my opinion on how I feel about trap beats as well. So if she's done that, that's a pretty big deal. <laughs> I think it's safe to say, as I said, that she is a born and bred to go to Eurovision at this point. In fact, I feel like she would even be like famous worldwide because of her music. It's very radio friendly and very mainstream as well, which can be a good thing, can be a bad thing, but in her instance, she's bringing that Israeli sound and where she's from in there, which I think is something that they don't do enough in mainstream media. So I think what we need to do next is to look at her other stuff just because so far the songs sound very different. So I'm very intrigued to see what else she's put out there. I know you guys have recommended to me Million Dollar and Bad Little Thing. So let me know if there's any other specific Noah Kirill songs you want me to react to next down in the comment section below. And also what you think of her song Pouch. I'm gonna go, but I will see you guys very, very soon. Bye-bye.